Hey there, good afternoon. So here we are, we have another massive um, haul here. It is um, Walmart, Dollarama, Dollar Tree, and um, Giant Tiger. So I'm gonna go over and I'm gonna do the Giant Tiger because it's the smaller one. So I'm gonna walk around, sorry, walk around my bed here and show you what we got at Dollar uh, Giant Tiger. So they had these frames on. Let me just, oops, sorry. The light's in your eyes there. Prop it up. It's um, one of an, it's an arched white frame and it holds six, uh, four by six pictures. And I'm excited to see what I can do with that. And then I also picked up um, a really nice fluffy gray blanket to go in my living room. We have a lot of, um, we have a lot of brown in there. We have a lot of um, tan. So I'm just kind of changing it up a little bit. And our blanket that we normally use right now is um, seen better days. So the other thing that we picked up, and I'm just going to turn this way, is a lot of cables. We need cords in this house like crazy. And the micro, um, the micro size. And we need the long cords. And we need the adapter to go into the wall. So I picked up those and it was pretty reasonable. I think some of them were $4, the long cord, the um, these long cords that are wrapped. They're really nice. We have a couple of those already, but um, I need um, one in my office to stay down there and the kids keep um, needing it. So we have to keep bringing it up and down. And then I think I got, let me pull these out, these pink and white ones and they're six and a half feet and th those are $4. So I did really well there. And then I went to, well, I went to Walmart first, but I went to Giant Tiger second, but I put the Walmart stuff here. So what I have, I bought myself some Sharpies, some cute colors. I just wanted um, a change in my office downstairs. And so I bought some Sharpies, you know, it's spring. I also picked up some stencils and these are letters and a little wreath there. I'm going to, I have a decor item I want to try. And that's really cute. That's on a mug. Looks like it's on a mug or a bucket or something. I want to try that. Um, I got those and then I also got a package of stencils that just does kind of like a square of a bunch of different um, textured things. So there's hearts and flowers and there's also kind of lines to make buffalo plaid and um, tiger and um, or whatever you call it, zebra stripes and stuff like that. So um, I got that. So I was thinking about decor for uh, the spring coming up. I picked up a tea towel pack. There's two in here. I think it was three something, $3.98. And there is a blue one and this cute uh, plaid. I love that. And then I also picked up two table runners. I have two tables. One has this cute bunny. Um, and then the other one is exactly the same as the plaid that um, I have for my tea towels. So I'm going to put that in my dining area when we decorate for Easter. And I'm finding, I know everyone's like, Easter already, it's not even um, Valentine's Day. You're right, it's not even Valentine's Day, 100%. But the way things are going right now with the pandemic, I am not taking any chances. Um, so I got a bunch of different candies and treats for Valentine's Day. I'm making up a care package for a couple of folks, and they have kiddos. So I'm going to throw in a bunch of different candies. And one of my friends has um, sons, so I'm going to pop that in there. I also picked up for the same group of care package, I picked up these really cute um, cell phone holders. Just little jokey items um, to put in these care packages and say, you know, I'm thinking about you. I know you're working from home and all that stuff. The other thing I got were a bunch of different compact mirrors with brushes. Just a little joke, um, you know, make sure that you're ready for the Zoom meeting. And they came in three different colors. I got purple and blue and then this really pretty light green for spring. Um, and this was again at uh, Dollar Tree, so a dollar twenty-five for a little cute little joke, just to tell them, you know, I'm thinking about you. Um, then, okay, ugly putty, which is in the shape of poo. Um, this is for Abby. She saw this last night when she went shopping with Tori and Dawn, and they pulled it out of the cart. And Abby realized when she opened her bag that it wasn't there. So crying ensued, and I want to surprise her and. Um, tell her that I heard she wanted some and she can have it but she can take it to mommy's house because we do not allow putty or any kind of like slime in the house so you probably have seen or if you haven't seen them I, we're making a fairy garden for Abby 
And these were a couple of things that she didn't have. So there's the cute little fairies um, playing together, little fairy sisters or friends. And then these cute, the unicorn with macaroons, I think that's cute. And then I also found one we didn't have, which was the hearts and the lollipops and the, um, the flowers. So I got that for her. I also found in the florals, I found these cute succulents for like $1.25. I thought we could put those into her fairy garden as well and I picked up like a green and a blue and they had this really cute lilac color one so I picked those up and then under here I saw this and I know sometimes I just need a little activity if um, Lucas is so great he will color or he'll use sort of more um, not adult coloring books but like coloring books that are a little bit more his older age appropriate Abby goes through the kid coloring books like crazy. She just colors and colors and colors. So I found this little package and picked that up for her. And then I also found some when I was in Dollar Tree. I, I, got, I found these first before I found the cables at Giant Tiger. I grabbed them because I didn't want to be without cables in case we needed them. So there's a navy one and um, a pink one. And they were $1.25. Um, like everything is $1.25 from the Dollar Tree. And I've been making some home decor items and some of them I am placing them on my tables and don't want to wreck the surface. So I'm going to put some felt pads on them so they don't scratch things. Like if they're unfinished wood and I finish the wood, like I paint it or use Mod Podge on it or something, I just don't want it to scrape my table later. So I did that. And then in the back here, I have a mirror and I'm not going to show you the mirror part. And then I have a candlestick. I'm going to make a riser for one of my, um, one of the pictures that I have in my bookcase. And I just want to try out and see if that riser will, will work. So stay tuned on that. I will definitely put that on Facebook. And then I'm going to come around the side here and show you the florals I got. Dollar Tree has done a really great job of having some really good florals. However, I haven't found exactly the flowers that I'm looking for. I am substituting. I really wanted pink and white tulips. I cannot find any that look nice at all. So I substituted and I went with tiger lilies and they're pretty, but um, I did do some pink ones and um, I also have th uh, three stems of the white and I liked those. I found some heather that was pretty and kind of a dusty rose color. And then I found these, which are pretty. They say that they're baby's breath, pink baby's breath. And then these gorgeous for Dollar Tree. These are gorgeous roses and I could only find one stem and I am going to be on the hunt for more at other Dollar Trees, but I only went, I only saw them at one Dollar Tree. Okay. So the next things I have are some home decor items and you may say, Vanessa, this is, those are so ugly. Yes, they are. The You Inspire Me and the Enjoy Simple Pleasures. It's a little house, little wooden house with uh, flowers on it and this uh, mason jar, but stay tuned because I plan to rip that all apart and sand those words down and find uh, something else to do with that. This home sign caught me as I was leaving and I love it. It's perfect the way it is. I'm gonna put it on one of my uh, bookcases and it's beautiful and it'll just be, it's got shiplap, uh, fake shiplap uh, behind. I love it and it's gonna be great. I also found, and I'll just pull these out, this really pretty family, um, it is wall decor, but I'm not using it on my wall. I'm going to use it on something else, so stay tuned. There'll be a DIY uh, coming up with that family decor. Okay, so what's next? Um, I did pick up one of their baskets, their little wicker or uh, wire waste baskets for Abby. She's got a new desk at her mummy's, and we're um, putting some things in her room. So I think I'm going to wrap some ribbon around the outside and then um, make it pretty and kind of jazz it up a little bit. It's boring. And I know she'll love it if I make it cute. So there's that. What else did I get? Sorry, I'm moving you all over. I found some pounce brushes. I just wanted to try something when I, I did buy stencils at Walmart and I didn't have any little sponge dabbers, so I grabbed those. And then I saw these cute um, craft clamps and I always work with wood and put things together, like I'm gluing something together. And I don't have any of my own clamps, and Dons are gross and ugly, and so I want to have my own cute ones. I also picked up a couple more of these frames. I have an idea. Stay tuned. There's some more things in my Dollarama haul that I will show you. Um, 
but you'll have to wait and see what I do with it all. And what else did I get? I got some craft roll because I need to cover some the backs of some signs that I'm making and for $1.25 you can't go wrong. And the last thing that I got, the last couple of bunch of things I got, I needed some pens and highlighters and pencils, mechanical pencils. I got these, I'm putting, like I said, I'm putting a care package together and um, for some folks that are working at home and I thought that I would grab some cool things and um, it's spring and I thought I would just put a springy spin on it. And then behind here, I also have four of the wreath rings, the uh, 14 inch ones. I was spending a lot of money at Walmart with buying an 18 inch ring. And so I just decided I was gonna see if I could find them at Dollar, cause I couldn't find them at Dollar Tree. So I bought a, a couple at Walmart. Now I found them at Dollar Tree and I'm going to try a couple spring wreaths and maybe keep a couple of them in my stash if I wanna make wreaths later. Okay, so we're coming around to the sunny spot. Sorry guys, I might block the, uh, the sun here. Um, then I got uh, some wire um, pen, pencil, kind of things for your desk. Those are for Abby. I am going to jazz them up. I thought about spray painting them white to match her, her wicker basket. Don told me that's too much work and just wrap ribbon around it, make it pretty and she'll love it. And I think he's probably right. Then I also found the cutest Evelyn and Crabtree um, body, body lotion or hand lotion. This stuff is what I would get if I was at like a high-end hotel. They would put out Evelyn and Crabtree. It's absolutely amazing lotion. I love it. And when I was traveling and staying at, I think it's at um, White Oaks has it or one of the higher end. Maybe it's the Double Tree. I'm not sure. But they have the most, I'm going to have to turn my camera, guys. Sorry. Um, they have the nicest, um, like, complimentary um, like uh, soaps and things like that and it's all Evelyn and Crabtree and it's like delicious it's so nice and um, you feel very luxurious so I grabbed again for a care package I'm going to throw those in and then I got four sets sorry you're going to see a glare here I'm going to move it into the shade I got four sets of these um, sheets 20 yard metallic um, in the kind of neutral metallics the golds the browns I got some in the uh, pastel green, pink, and blue. I got some shiplap in some different colors. And I also got some shiplap in some more traditional colors of um, like decor. So like the, the browns, the grays, the white. And then they threw in a blue one, which I thought was kind of cool. So I got four packages and two of each package. And I absolutely love them. So I'm excited to play around with those. I picked up a three pack of these pots that come in their little tray and I don't know if I'm going to use them all together I probably will but they're galvanized flower pots they were three dollars at uh, Dollarama this is my Dollarama haul now as I come around here and I like I like them Abby's gonna be making a fairy garden so I wanted to have some options if I need to make some uh, adjustments and she's got lots and lots of stuff for her fairy garden so stay tuned we'll probably be putting that together very shortly and then for Easter I fell in love with these eggs these little ceramic eggs okay there's purple and white and yellow and blue and I know there's a pink one I'm going to be on the hunt don't think I won't the only reason I went into Dollarama today was not for all this stuff it was for this guy this beautiful little bunny he is going to adorn the top of my tear tray this year and I'm very excited I finally got one I saw them all over uh, the YouTube has uh, YouTube has them all over people are putting videos up and I was like I want one of those and my Dollaramas never had them and today I was lucky so very happy about that a couple bucks three bucks and it'll be beautiful I also picked up a pencil uh, sharpener for myself I need one down in my room in, in my office the kids keep stealing all of my office supplies and I understand because they're trying to do schoolwork and stuff but seriously I need to uh, have some stuff for myself and then I picked up these cute little, um, they're carrots and they're made, they have kind of like a twine, um, made out of jute rope or twine and they're sparkly. I don't know. I've been seeing people do crafts with them. I want to try something. So I bought those. I also picked up some Easter tea towels, cute, bright colors. I think I'll be putting those on my little tea towel ladder that I got. So I was very excited. And uh, I did get other tea towels, but these ones are actually to like dry your hands on, not actually dry your dishes. 
I picked up some cute wooden shapes. Oops, I'm getting a glare from the light. Sorry. Um, I know I should know more about how to video. I do not. I am not. I guess I'm not a true Cranford. <laughs> I'm not a videographer. My family's into video, but um, I totally suck at it. That's okay. You can see the product. You know what it is. It's wooden shapes. I have some ideas for a cute banner that I want to do for um, Easter. I also picked up these really pretty, you can't really see it now because the glare of the darn sun, these really pretty butterflies. They're kind of plasticky. I have an amazing DIY plan for these. I am not leaving them like this. They are going to be Vanessified before I can, uh, before you can say go. I will have these ripped apart and repurposed and with a fresh coat of something on there, but they will not look like that. And what else did I get? I got some journals. Again, doing some care packages. I thought these journals were absolutely gorgeous and they're lined and they have a cute little elastic on them. And there's some really cute prints on the front. And I was really excited to find those. And then behind that sweet wooden bunny, I have a couple other wooden bunny things to go on my tiered tray and um, some of my home decor. And I just grabbed that. It was really cute. I liked it. And the other thing I found were these really cute post-it notes. And if I can open it up and show you, let me find one that's open. Okay, here, look. So they're not real, like regular post-its. They're, they're fancy. They're, they're springy. They're beautiful. And look at those butterflies. Like that is probably going to be one of my packs. I bought enough for myself. And then I'm, like I said, doing up some care packages. They will go in there. Super, super good find. I mean, I'm talking post-its are really, really expensive. These are, I would pay for a regular post-it price, but these were not regular post-it price. I'm so happy that I got these cute things. And the last thing that I picked up was this beautiful friend and we all know who that's going to go to because I have just finished crocheting something for Lucas and Abby wanted something but I thought you know she would like this better so I bought this for her when I was going through Dollarama and again three bucks beautiful so now I uh I have all this stuff to put away and I have to get crafting because I would love to show you my decorated house for East for Valentine's but uh, I got to go finish some stuff. So have a great day and I hope you enjoyed this haul.